All right, so before December 11th and the brand new Salvage Yard business DLC comes into Grand Theft Auto 5 for the winter update, what we're going to be doing is potentially taking advantage of one of the most easiest missions here. So Angels is a good one because that does diss out some good money. But right now we've got the Project Overthrow until December 11th dishing out double cash and double RP. So we're going to go ahead and click on this and then the bottom one down here. So Breaking Ranks. This is the one to be like one of the easiest missions you guys can be doing here and once again is dishing out double cash and double rp so when we load up this mission in the settings we're going to want to put that to hard mode right there go ahead and confirm everything you guys might want to think about grabbing some armor because we will be getting shot at and then from here it's going to be up to you this can be done solo but i do recommend grabbing some players right here we got like a level 14 so that's going to be a, like a level of trust that i don't usually do with people but what the heck we'll bring them with us anyways all right, so we're going to start off in our Avenger, and when our, like, Avenger starts flying, we have the ability to. We're just going to fly on out to Grapeseed here, which is located way out here. There's going to be a warehouse that is surrounded by NPC enemies. I suggest you and your comrades go ahead and get on the big guns of the Avenger and start shooting up the warehouse. Light up all these bad guys like these NPCs. They all have to get destroyed. And then after they get destroyed, we're going to need to go ahead and park the Avenger on over at the Sandy Shores Air Park, which is just, like, right over there. And then from here, you guys can exit the Avenger and grab some dirt bikes and head back on over to the warehouse. And then from here, we're going to enter the warehouse. So this is something you guys do not want to do. It's something that I did because I wasn't sure. And I just was like, whatever, we're just going to like... I know, I know it looks like I did this on purpose, but I didn't do that on purpose necessarily. Throw that sticky bomb. So don't go in here with any explosions, what I'm saying, because I ended up blowing up our getaway vehicle and they ended up failing the mission on us but we ended up getting four thousand one hundred and like ten dollars right there so we're gonna go ahead and add that later on and plus a thousand rp so that's gonna be like the overall part right there we're gonna add that on to later right so don't blow things up like like i did basically is what i'm saying here so from there just take your assault shotgun run through here destroy all of the npc enemies and then from there, we're just going to be collecting parts. So there's going to be a number of parts in here in which we have to collect and then deliver them back to the van itself. Just pick them up. Anybody can do this. And if you have like a four-man team, it's going to go a little bit quicker because everybody has to just grab something and then just get back into the van at this time. So when we grab, once we grab all the parts and we are back in the van, all we're going to have to do is just simply is just going to like give us a black screen. We're going to wind up outside and then from there, we're going to head on back on over towards the Avenger. So the Avenger is still parked, remember, on over at the airfield. So we're just going to head on back there real quick. And then what's going to happen here is the Avenger is actually going to get blown up. It's going to be like... A lot of NPC bad guys over there or something. Bad stuff is going to happen. So what we're going to do is go ahead and turn right around and start heading towards the freeway. All right. So just be mindful. There's going to be mortar explosions. There's also going to be merry weather jeeps that are going to be attacking you guys. Just stay on the freeway and just simply shoot and try to avoid all of the merry weather explosions. And also it getting <laughs> a turtle dust yeah, and also getting rid of the jeeps there. So as long as everybody's shooting, we should be good. The van's taking a little bit of damage. The doors have gotten ripped off. The windows are all broken out. But you know what? We ended up completing that mission. And I just want to go ahead and show you guys with the double cash and the double RP on hard mode how much this is dishing out. Because by far, that is the easiest mission in Project Overthrow, in my opinion at least. All right, so there it is, $51,840. And remind you guys, too, about that $4,100 that I got earlier, which makes it over $55,000 for completing one of the easiest overthrow missions right now in Grand Theft Auto V until December 11th. And that brand new DLC ends up dropping. So from there, if you guys ended up enjoying this video and it was helpful and you ended up making a ton of money running Breaking Ranks, which is the easiest project overthrow mission by far, in my opinion. Hit that like button down below on the way out. Subscribe for new content so you guys don't miss out on daily GTA 5 online videos that we post here. And go follow me on Twitter so you guys don't miss out on any other videos that get posted on over there and shared. But from there, thank you all for watching. Hope you're all having an awesome rest of the day. My name is Gravesite. Green Alien, and I'm out of here, so peace!